how's it going y'all welcome back to the channel and as always before the content is delved into be sure to hit that subscribe button because it will be very nice of y'all to press it like the video also if you haven't done so yet today let me show you guys real quick we will be taking care of some uh, scratches as you can see this scratch is not very deep of a scratch you can still see it but it's not like deep into the metal so i think we can definitely uh, compound and polish it out and we got some minor scratch over here this one looks like it's pretty hefty so i want to try to do that one also as well as some of these right here over here i got some of the stuff we're doing today so i got my uh, polishing and compounding pads so the yellow is the heaviest cut moving this way towards the lighter cut got my chemicals here so first i'm actually going to be stripping the uh older wax surfaces so the compound and polish can uh, adhere better and remove the uh, scratch and then these are the uh, compound and polish this right here is a compound from Megwars. it is only rotary usage which i do have and i also got these two they are the v36 and v38 from chemical guys they are cutting polish and pretty much the 36 is that in between kind of cutting power and the v38 is that final finishing polish so what i think i'm gonna do is hit it with the v36 first and see how it reacts with the cuts or with the uh, scratch and afterwards i want to assess what's going on and go from there this is a rotary polisher from uh, drill master rotary is pretty dank to use but in the wrong hands it can do some damages so i wouldn't suggest using a rotary if you don't have any experience because it creates a lot of heat what i'm gonna do is just spray on just like that and then wipe off the old layer of wax okay i think it's stripped pretty good most of the time for lighter scratches the v36 from chemical guys should be fine but you never know probably like two a little goes a long way so just gonna be doing that put it on just like so so now I'm just gonna set it down to probably one and a half speed and go to town with it gets kind of tricky with the um, rotary because sometimes it pulls you away and kind of make you eat yourself let's see here you still kind of see it right here so from here all the way to around here but from far away can't see it at all so i guess the v36 did a pretty good job with that let's check right here though spread it on and go to town with it You still can uh, kind of see it right here in this area, but again, far away, not too shabby. So I think the <laughs> V36 did a pretty good job, I'd say. So no need for the cutting compound. So for the final polishing V38, I'm going to be using the light cutting pad for obvious reasons. 
This is probably too much, but we will see. The V36 and V38 did a great job at removing them scratch that just saved me some time with the uh, compound so now i'm just going to be hitting it with a hyper ceramic liquid wax from mega wars because that is what the uh, rav4 had earlier So the Megoris Ceramic Hybrid Liquid Wax, it doesn't actually haze like a uh, regular kind of wax. Um, you still kind of see it, but it's not really in your face kind of haze. So you just gotta be careful and know when to wipe it off, about two minutes or so. But read the directions, of course. Now there's no more scratches on the car. And with that, I guess I should be signing out. And I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Again, be sure to like and subscribe. I will catch you guys on the flip side.